Right, just to give you a starting point. This morning I filmed, edited the um, video uh, Surprises and Plans. This was my son's bedroom. It's going to become our bedroom once I've decorated. And this is how it stands at the moment. It needs some work doing on it. Yes, there's still some things of us here, as you can see. It's not empty. I wanted to start decorating on Saturday. He didn't move out until yesterday, which was Monday. But he's still got all this junk to sort out and take with him. So it looks like I'm not going to be decorating today either, which is just annoying me no end. But he says an awful lot of this he doesn't actually want. Even these dumbbells. Um, so he's, he's going through them. He says he's going through them. But I think I'll put them on free cycle. He came by about two hours ago because he's going to paint the ceiling for me. Um, save me going up and down step ladders. And obviously empty the rest of the room. He nipped out to get himself um, bacon butty or something like that. And he still hasn't come back yet. So... It's just, it's just like everything else. If I want it doing, I've got to do it myself. Because if I don't do it myself, I'm waiting days, even weeks and months. So, this is how it stands at the moment. But moving in here in the morning when I get up, I can look out into my garden. This is an angle you do not see at all normally. Right, that's with the window open. So you can see exactly where that is now. That's my celery. Going on to the lakes. Peas, going up to the runner beans, roof of my summer house, just see the sweet corn and my apple tree. So this gives you a better sort of scale idea of how much room I've actually got. It isn't much <laughs> at all. Considering the amount of food I get out of that small space. But, like the name says, it's little, it's an urban setting, and it's my homestead. But this also shows you the waste ground that's next to my house. And down there I go and pick blackberries and over there elderberry trees they are different point of view loads of money but he just empties his pockets and throws it on the window ledge and there is still bits on the floor uh, I'd picked up yesterday started counting some of it out and got to nearly 30 pounds so if he doesn't come back and decorate the ceiling, I'm going to start it and I'm going to have this money. This is going to be my payment for doing the work that he said he was going to do.
What a difference a couple of days makes. The room is not finished, but at least we can now move in it. So I treated myself and bought a new bedspread. It's a perfect situation 